analog, though, <laughs> at the moment. I'll try and get it to be digital with time. Joining us now is the Acting Chief Technology Officer in the SABC, Gelfand Kaiser. Good morning to you. Good morning, Phil. Well, How are you? And I'm uh, very morning well. to the viewers as well. Thank you for joining us this morning. Briefly, yes. DTT. What is DTT? DTT, uh, Digital Terrestrial Television, is the transmission of television signals over the air, terrestrially over the land, using digital means. Okay. Yes. What are we doing now? What we're doing now is we're broadcasting also terrestrial but using analog means. Okay. Yes. So the quality of the picture is different? The quality is definitely different. Yeah. It's okay. better in DTT than it is on analog. So we're migrating? We are migrating yeah. from analog to digital. And how long is this taking us? The migration can take anything up to six years or even more. Really? Yes. But uh, you know there are different timelines set with uh, experiences that have been learned from uh, you know across the globe okay so for the sabc for the sabc we have to prepare ourselves currently we are busy preparing ourselves for the launch but uh, you know we fall in line with uh, the the announced um, there are you know time timelines okay milestones that that must be met by by you know every broadcaster in the southern african uh, tip okay. so we have to fall in those lines what are our key landmarks timelines our, our key landmarks is uh, you know the government has announced that by you know by april next year yeah. which is 2012 we as a public broadcaster should be able to actually you know broadcast on dtt okay so we are doing preparations right now in order to to make that deadline what does that mean doing preparations means what means we have to you know uh get the equipment okay and get the you know uh, the, the 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 configuration of the set top box in consultation with the manufacturers to comply with certain standards that have been set by the international telecommunications union okay so this process entails industry getting together you know all the role players actually meeting you know several times uh, to try and map out a strategy of actually yeah. delivering this. What is the, the, the value for the SABC? What is the size of the investment? The, this, it's, it's huge. I mean, in money terms, I, you know, I wouldn't be able to disclose to you right now in terms of money terms. But what we know, Vuyo, is that, uh, for instance, a broadcaster right now, yeah. you know, we suffer a lot of criticism if we fail to broadcast a, a, a game live yeah. because of the lack of, of channels that we have got currently. So with DTT, you know, you know it allows us to have more channels okay. so that we can play around more. We have more space in which to broadcast. So you were saying from April next year. From Does this mean from April next year the SABC will have more channels? It means that we will be starting. So it's a start. Okay. So we will be able, once you roll out DTT, yeah. the, you know, the, 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 the sky is the limit. Because okay. basically you will have more channels. You can run all the way up to 17 or 18 okay. channels. We've run out of time. Yes. Our viewers, the most yes. important people. Yes. What does this mean for them? For the viewers, it means they've got better options, okay. better quality. Yeah. For the viewers, it means they've got more language options in yeah. the in the in the language of their choice. Okay. With uh, you know additional what you call value adds on okay. on, 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 on on the TV box. Thank you very much. Kelfan Casio is the acting chief technology officer here at the SABC. It's about an enhanced viewing experience, such as what you get on Morning Live every morning. Good morning to you.